Well, now Sarah Ennis and Woodcourt Garrison for Ireland. Third team rider for Ireland. This uh, Irish sport horse, nine-year-old stallion by Garrison Royal, owned by uh, Freda Kennedy. Woodcourt uh, Garrison goes to the uh, Red Dirt. And the trailer at two as uh, Laura Hergaben and Pivas down the corner at 20. Jumps that very nicely. A good job of that turn. Panels. This has caused a lot of trouble actually, this fence down here at 21B. They need to just pop in over that fence. There's a big drop on the landing and then this tight turn. And on the four strides, it comes up very quickly. On the five, you need to be really steady. Vittoria Panetson and Supercilius for Italy, going towards 13 and 14. Very experienced rider across the country. Right lower leg position. Oh, just hits the first of the corners, but better over the second. She'll disappear through the trees. Jump up one more single fence before the water. Uh, Sarah Ennis, well, what a year she's had. She's riding Woodcourt Garrison here. She rode uh, a very good round at the World Equestrian Games in Tryon. Horse where Stella rebounds. Sarah Ennis goes on to the vegetable box at five. So just two fences left to jump for Lou, Laura Hergard, Laura Hergaven, and uh, Quibus. Hergaven down towards the final fence, having jumped the steeplechase fence. She's some 42, 43 seconds over. Remember, she's had 20 jumping penalties as well. So Laura Hergaven and Quivis, they stop the clock, and it's 19.2 time for these 20 jumping penalties. They finish on 75.4 and go into 40th place. That one refusal at uh, fence 14. Well, the uh, team standings, it's uh, still Germany, Great Britain, Sweden in that order. But we've got uh, still a number of riders to come in the team competition. It is Vittoria Panetson and Supercilius taking the middle direct route at the water at 16. Looks uh, full of running. It's an important round now for Italy. And Sarah Ennis, Sarah with the horseware cello rebound, finished fifth individually at those World Equestrian Games. And uh, what a time they had. The Irish team, not only here, but uh, they're going from strength to strength. And they've got a really good team and uh, team of horses and riders coming up through the ranks. And Sarah, part of that silver medal winning team at the World Equestrian Games, really riding on a high now. Well, now uh, Nicolas Tuzon with uh, Vendy Globe Jack. This nine year old gilding by Quality Touch. Grand Prix uh, show jumper. Picked up the ride from uh, Kevin Stotes. And it's great to see that uh, this horse has taken so well to eventing. Vittoria Panetson and Supercilius going towards the latter part of the course now. She's gone right to the far side, right to the left-hand side. And then back slightly right-handed. Just about gets her turn, we think, to the second of those brush panels. Sarah Ennis and 
Westwood Court Garrison safely through 12. So up to 13 and 14, this is where Laura Hoogerven had her problem with Quibus, taking the far left-hand side. Back, she's taking the right-hand side, not as far over as it looks. She's going the slightly longer route. And Woodcourt Garrison, just nine years old by Garrison Royal. So that may be a very sensible bit of riding from Sarah as she gallops her through the trees. Well, now it is the uh, turn at uh, four for Nicolas Toussaint and uh, the lovely Vendy Globe Jack, HDC. Go on to the vegetable rack at five. Victoria Panetson with uh, Chick Paget, Deborah Bevan and Juliet Donalds. Supercilious. Supercilious bred by Sarah Bullen at the final fence. Her time will be interesting because it was a clear round jumping, 10 seconds over. That incurs just four time penalties for Vittoria Panetson for Italy. And a useful score in the team standings as well for her. Just waiting for that score to come in. Four time penalties it is, 34.4. They just drop outside the top 10 in 11th place. Sarah Ennis now down to the water at 16 with Woodcourt Garrison. Eyes up, she's got her eyes focused on these uh, two big fences in the water, gets quite close to the second of those. Makes the three strides look very easy because it walked quite long in the water, but making that look very easy, that distance. Nicolas Toussaint with Vendy Globe Jack, HDC going the longer routes up at eight. Glaive Jack HDC, just a nine years old. Watch how wet he really stands off and just gets the three strides in there. Woodcourt Garrison, very keen, very full of running. Up at nine now, Nicholas Tudon. He's a ride quite hard. Well, away from the start, it is uh, now the last uh, team rider for Great Britain in this third rotation. Alex Bragg with Shenandoah Percy. It's owned by Sarah Hughes, bred by the Shenandoah Studs. Uh, Martin Walsh, eight-year-old by Shenandoah, Sarkos and Gieven. Sarah Ennis and Woodcourt Garrison down to the corner at 20. Well, jumps the corner beautifully at 20 as she makes her way towards the final few jumping efforts out on course. Just makes the turn. A big horse to make that turn as well. So Nicolas Tuzart, the former team gold medalist from the Athens Olympic Games back in 2004. He's been uh, world champion in 2006. And has had an illustrious career. Well, Sarah Ennis and uh, 
Woodcourt Garrison coming to the last. She's not going to quite make the time. Some 11, 12, 13 seconds over. It is the 13 seconds over. 40.5 is her score. 5.2 time penalties. She finished on 40.5 and goes into 22nd place. Ireland then.